Hey guys, Steve Per here. Welcome back to the channel. I hope everyone's doing well. In today's video, we'll be going over how you can find ships on the planet and why you should not do it. It absolutely shits me that we as a community need to find workarounds as to how you can find ships on the planet after the latest patch. It's a process and I don't recommend you do it because A, it takes too long, B, it is boring and it's just not efficient. As far as efficiency goes, this is the least efficient method. But anyways, I'm going to go through with it and showcase it nonetheless. Now, without further ado, let's get stuck into it. Find ourselves a nice flat spot on the map and then see what it spawns. Now the issue here is, right, whatever it spawns, you're kind of stuck with it. It's not guaranteed it's going to be behind a ship, and then if it's not, then you have to repeat the whole process over and over and over again. And it's extremely, extremely time consuming. And the ships that you can get to land planet side will vary greatly from planet to planet. And there's only a specific list of ships that can drop on a planet at a time. So. Even when you reach this safe scammer, it will take you like 40 to 50 attempts to get anything remotely good that's a class C ship. You keep getting the stilettos, you keep getting all sorts of ships except for what you need. Now anyways, uh, let's get through to this. Find a nice flat landing surface. All right, so we are now five minutes in and we have our first ship landing and it's an absolute trash ship. So it's about to land. All right, now you'll notice I quick saved my game just before now if my theory is correct and you can safe scam this what what is this ship what do we have wait you see security is attacking me what the heck oh <laughs> what oh what <laughs> um all right um yeah okay okay dudes all right whatever um, I'll, I'll, just because he attacked me, I'll take a piece of crap ship anyway. Um, cool. So what do, what do we have here anyway? We got... What is this? Security freighter. Class A reactor. It's got what does it have? Proton cannons and some missiles. All right, now let's test out my theory. <coughs> Can we safe scam it? Can we safe scam it? Okay, that's a landing pot spot there. So you will have to continuously quick save, continuously. And the three, and the two, and the one, and the no? No? Alright, so you can't save scam it. Oh, there you have it. That is absolutely dog poop. So, Took me five minutes to find the location, and then a ship landed. It was not a high-end ship. Let them well, think about it this way, right? If it takes forty to fifty safe scams to do it when you used to work the method, just just think about it logically, right? If it takes forty to fifty safe scams to get a good ship using the old method, which is exactly like this method that will come and land there. How many times do you have to redo this? And when 
before it would be like quick load, quick load, quick load, quick load. Now you have to repeat this process five, even even if you were quicker, say three minutes at a time. And you gotta do that what fifty times to get a, a what like a, a a decent ship. Come on, guys. So that's just, and that's what is this whole thing pains me. It's just. Why do we as a community have to do this, have to find these workarounds where, you know, we as consumers, you as consumers, should hold the devs to high standard. I'm the biggest advocate when it comes to this game. I love this game, right? My whole channel is based around this game, but we got to call bullshit for what it is, right? That's, that's just absolutely silly. So... I have to now go back to my ship and redo the whole process. That's just unacceptable. That is absolutely unacceptable. It's just trash. I'm not bashing the game. I'm just bashing the workaround that we have to do to find the ship. Now, this adversely to going in space. Um, what's... <laughs> yeah, you can't compare the two. When we did the space method, we got an Autobahn... Ah, uh, not Autobahn, sorry. We got a Voyager and a Claymore 3 within like minutes. Claymore was like within seconds. So... Yes, there is a method, there is a workaround, but the, the, the time, like the, the value for the time is just not there. Yeah, it's, it isn't. And it's not okay. It's, it's just not okay. Yes, there is a workaround, we accept it for what it is. That's just not okay. It's not right. Yeah, this is turning out to be a monumental waste of time, guys. I just don't see the potential benefits here at all. Let's see if we can find another landing site. Alright, so possible ship landing location straight ahead there. Let's go and check it out. It has now been 27 minutes we've had one ship drop. Just to put things in perspective, right? 27 minutes, one ship drop, and now if we are somewhat lucky, we might get a second one. That most definitely looks like a landing spot straight ahead there. And you can easily tell because it bulges out. Okay, are we going to get anything to land? Where are we still too far away? I might still be too far away. That is definitely a landing spot, but nothing's landing. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is a landing spot. Dang it. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Well, there you have it guys. Now, let's try the space method. So, 30 minutes. 30 minutes, one ship sighting. Just one. <sighs> Alright, we're back. The game crashed. Now, we'll give it 10 to 15 seconds and then we'll move on to another planet. Something's bound to spawn here or intercept us. If not, we just move on. Nope, nothing there. Off to Hawking 5. So we got one hyena there. Raven. Two hyenas. They're not hyenas, three, so we're not interested. Get out of here, get melted. Wait, do we want a normal hyena? Nah, probably not. Well, that's already more random encounters in like two minutes than we've had. I don't know. I, I'll, let, I'll let you guys be the judges. I mean, space combat's not that difficult. If you're someone that's struggling with space combat, just slap a couple of turrets on. Problem solved. <laughs> I might do a tutorial uh, to show you guys how uh, how is the easiest way to do space combat. Um, anyways, let's go down to this way. Okay, 10 seconds, 15 seconds, and then we'll move. Alright. Let's go to... Where we want to go to? Let's go Hawking 6A. What do we have here, guys? Free Star Transpo 3. Uh, you, don't want, you don't want that ship. You do not want that ship. Let's go, Hawking 6. Give it a few seconds. Ecliptic, just one? Damn, you guys gonna need more than that. Okay. Next. What do we have here, ladies and gentlemen? USAC longsword, phalanx. Anything good here? Longsword? Nah, we don't care for that. You don't want to return the hail. That's okay. Pilgrims. We don't care about pilgrims. Walking four. And we move to Archimedes. Give it five ten seconds. Okay. Spaces, hyena. No hyena, three about. You know, we've been doing this for five minutes and we've had all these ships spawn. Just get rid of him. Oh, there you go. Oh, no. Yeah, yeah, Oh, Raven, sorry. I thought it was a hyena 3. 
Got all excited there. Uh, we, don't, we don't care for you, buddy. Get out of here. Let's see what these guys have, and then we'll move on. Uh, this is way more fun than just running on planet surfaces, doing nothing. And <laughs> just hoping that a ship would land. Let's just see what's down there and then we'll move on. Okay. Next up, we're gonna head down to Archimedes. Uh, by now you get the point, like... You can be running board shitless on the planet, hoping, praying that a ship would land. Or you can just do this and get all the best ships anyways. <laughs> and much more, have more fun doing it. And level up in the process too. What do we have here? Three star space hawks, not interested. Trade a Highlander. Highlander is good, but not that Highlander. We want a, a different one. They're not too common, those Highlanders. But Highlander 3 is what you want. Okay, next. Free star, stiletto. Stiletto, stiletto. They're all stiletto. Sledder 3 is not bad. Very nimble. That's a class CD if you want the Nimitz, you can definitely go for it. I'll take the ship parts, thank you very much. You take care too. Okay, if that was a crossbow, I would have taken it. We'll move. Alright, Archimedes 1A. Just debris from the fight that we had. we we'll move. Okay, let's see if anyone ambushes us here. Likely not. Why is there still debris flying? That's so annoying. Um, let's go down here. Okay, give it some time. Nothing will move. That is nothing spectacular. Transpo, not interested. Archimedes 5. What is this here, ladies and gentlemen? Carry all. It's a big boy, but no. Alright, what do we have here? Spacer. Wait for the other guys to spawn. 
and then we'll light him up. Are you by yourself? You're very unfortunate there, bud. Well, unfortunate for him. We'll give it like a few more seconds, see if anyone else wants. Doesn't seem like anything else is going to spawn. Okay, we shall move on. Okay, let's see what's down there. Hyena 2, Raven, Coyote. So we'll, we'll soak it up. We'll soak it all up. I don't care. We got plenty of ship parts. Let him try shoot at us. Get back here. Alright, let's go get ourselves a hyena too. Just for the collection. Actually, do we do we want this? Nah. Nah, it's a waste of time. Either hyena three or nothing. Hyena three or nothing, ladies and gentlemen. Titanium, ship parts. Uh, we'll do one more Archimedes and then we'll move on. So, but by now you get the point. There's so many more random encounters in space over a much shorter period of time as opposed to just landing on a planet and hoping. As I said, it usually takes you 40 to 50 safe scamming to get some of these. Yell Bank Storm Rider 2. We'll definitely take this. This is a good ship. Storm Rider 3 is the best, but Storm Rider 2 is not bad. So. I'm not gonna waste my time with a Storm Rider 2 though. Uh, let's go Archimedes 1. What is that? It's trash, Space Ox. Okay, that's trash, we don't care about that. I'll go Hudgens quickly. Dagger Chimera two Phalanx 3, Chimera 3 or nothing guys, we got high standards here. But a Chimera 2 is not bad, by, not bad at all. By no means, but Chimera 3 is what you want. So it's one of these. Where is it? One of these babies. Okay, what do we have here? Mysterious Captain. Give it five ten seconds. Ah, 
Nothing. Okay. Okay. Just rotate clockwise, I guess. Anything? Hello? No. Next. Set the mule, we don't care for that. Mrs. Whitmore, no, thank you. Some time. Nope. Police colonies. Oh, hell no. Space, uh, Jacko, Hyena 2. And we keep getting these Hyenas 2 and no Hyenas 3. Uh, it's just unlucky. At least we, we're getting, you know, three ships at a time. So I guess there is a chance that it can be a Hyena 3 rather than just one ship at a time. So probability is much higher. What do we have here? Hoptile, Phalanx. All in a day's work for UC security. Not everyone would have stuck their necks out for a patrol. Thanks. Any way we can repay you? Yes, yeah, just give me those ship parts. Thank you very much. Transferring parts now. Thanks again for the help. You, oh, you won't be thanking me if you have a Chimera 3 in here somewhere. So that's one. Phalanx 2. No chimeras? That doesn't look like there are chimeras. That's fine. Okay, we we'll move. Five, ten seconds. Guys, we're getting random encounter after random encounter after random encounter, so you see the logic in this, right? Just higher probability, much, much higher probability, and fraction of the time. Okay, next. Give it five ten seconds. Crimson Flayed. Banshee. Banshee's just a small ship. Do you know what? Can I?
Yeah, we give it a sec. Yeah, I, I, I want this banshee. Just get it down. What do you think you're going, buddy? Go grab this banshee. Why not? It's a good looking ship. Anyways guys, that's it for this one. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below whether you agree or disagree with me. Just because there is a workaround, it doesn't mean we should do it. Or we should hold them to a higher, higher standard. At least that's just my personal opinion. Hopefully they, they patch things back up. But for now, stick to space. It's much, much better way of obtaining ships. Anyways, thank you for your time and I hope to catch you in the next video. Peace.